Hey guys, so today I'll be unboxing a beautiful wig from XRS Beauty Hair. So let's do our little unboxing. The first thing I'll be showing you guys is this that's a cool edge brush type thing that has like this thing that you like lay down the glue to. Those are adjustable straps so the wig is tight, ball cap, and some flexi rods. And a nice wide tooth comb. So we'll be going right in with the install. You didn't know the first thing you have to do is lay that ball cap. So it's best to get a ball cap that is matching of your skin tone. But if it's not, you can always use foundation to make it that way. Even if it matches my skin tone skin tone, sorry, I still use foundation to make sure that she is melted. Once this bad boy is on, I get my scissors and I make two little incisions. One here. This is for my ear. <laughs> oh, that kind of rhymes, what the hell? <laughs> and the next one on my other side. Okay, so once I'm done, I showed you guys the wig. This is it straight out of the package. It's a beautiful body wave wig, but then I washed it so the body wave did wave goodbye. <laughs> And then it was like gone and I was like what the hell but then I was like okay whatever continue <laughs> this is a 20 inch wig like girl that shit does not look 20 inches it's also a 13 by 6 lace front clean hairline wig you'll see what I mean real soon but anyways I just showed you guys the wonder lace bond spray and i just sprayed it all around my hairline on the ball cap then i'm gonna get my hair dryer acting a fool <laughs> and make sure this shit is dry so then i can go in with my second layer So now I'm going to show you how good quality this lace is. This is their new clear lace and I'm just going to use got to be and spray it on my hand and let you guys see how melted this is. Guys just look at that it hasn't been sprayed as yet and it's already chef's kiss like bro get you some uh, get you some link in the description box but anyways i dropped it <laughs> but now i'm gonna spray it on and i'm gonna see the magic happen
you guys already don't know the procedure spray it then blow dry blow dryer is the best friend to a lace front literally if you don't have a blow dryer your lace most likely you're gonna look whack you need it to melt okay because the importance of doing all of this is making sure that any glue you're working with is dry or a bit tacky let's say tacky As you can see, the lace really blend, really blend in my skin. So guess what, guys? Guess what? If you want to lace like this, just go shop at XRS Beauty Hair because they have this new clean hairline thing. I'm gonna show you guys real quick, and they have this new clear lace. Like when them say clear, literally clear, 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 clear we're talking about crystal clear baby crystal clear So you see how the lace is undetectable? That's the same lace on this wig and the hairline is already pre-plucked and it looks way more natural than the regular pre-plucked hair. They customized it, this natural hairline, so it can melt in the skin perfectly. Okay, so now I'm just using my foundation and going over the bar cap so it matches my skin tone this foundation is a little bit darker than me but you know whatever once that is done it's time to cut the bar cap so it matches how it matches the shape of your hairline. So once that's done, we go in with our first layer of glue. So me personally, I like to use a popsicle stick and flatten out the glue so it's not like bumpy. And it helps melt the lace even better. So I finished all that. Now I'm cutting the lace with a razor. Because guys, please don't cut your lace with a regular scissors. You're going to look like you have a lineup. I don't know how much time I forgot to say that, but don't do it. And look at that shit, not even melted yet and undetectable. So this is the finished look. Cute, cute, cute. I did bangs, but as you can see, lace wear. I don't know what I have to write this up. But ignore her.
Tu dia kai. Bibo, we in my business here. Yeah.